Initiating surprise in three, two, one. I made it all up. Surprise. Oh, come on. If it makes you feel any better, they abandoned you at birth. So I very seriously doubt they'd even want to see you. awful about that surprise. Tell you what, let's give your parents a call right now. The birth parents you are trying to reach do not love you. Please hang up. Oh, that's sad. But impressive. Maybe they worked at the phone company. I talked my way onto the old nanobot work crew rebuilding this shaft. They are really small. So, oh. I know, Jerry. No, I'm on a break, mate. On a break. Ah! Just hang in there for five more. What, Jerry? You can't fire me for that. Yes, Jerry. Or maybe your prejudiced work site should have accommodated a nanobot of my size. Thanks for the hate crime, Jer. See you in court, mate. Anyway, look, just hang in there for, for five more chambers. Well, you know the old formula. Comedy equals tragedy plus time. And you have been asleep for a while. So I guess it's actually pretty funny when you do the math. <laughs>
I thought about our dilemma, and I came up with a solution that I honestly think works out best for one of both of us. Federal regulations require me to warn you that this next test chamber is looking pretty good. That's right, the facility is completely operational again. I think these test chambers look even better than they did before. It was easy, really. You just have to look at things objectively, see what you don't need anymore, and trim out the fat. I've got a surprise for you after this next test. Not a fake, tragic surprise like last time. A real surprise with tragic consequences. And real confetti this time. The good stuff. Our last bag. Part of me is going to miss it. But at the end of the day, it was just taking up. What's going on? Who turned off the lights? Hey, buddy! I'm speaking in an accent that is beyond her range of hearing. Look, Metal Ball, I can hear you. Run! I don't need to do the voice. Run! 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 Come on, I'm closing the door. Okay, quickly, now we are escaping. All right, that's what's happening now. We're escaping. Uh, so you're doing great. Just keep running. Uh, quick word about the future plans that I've got in store. We're going to shut down her turret production line, all right? Turn off her neurotoxin and then confront her. For the moment. Run! Come on, let's go. The irony is you are almost at the last test. Here it is. Why don't you just do it? Trust me, it's an easier way out than whatever asinine plan your friend. Wait, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh look, there's a deer. You probably can't see it. Get closer. The irony is you are almost at the last test. Here it is. Why don't you just do it? Trust me, it's an easier way out than whatever asinine plan your friend came up with. Oh, what? Come on, how stupid did... Oh! Come on, let's go.
You made it through. Well done. Okay, follow me. We've still got work to do. At least she can't touch us back here. What's happening? Um, hmm. Okay. Okay, d uh, don't move. Okay, all right, so, I've got an idea, but it is bloody dangerous. Here we go. Ah! Oh, for God's sake, they told me that if I ever turned this flashlight on, I would die. They told me that about everything. I mean, I, I don't even know why they bothered giving me this stuff if they didn't want me to use it. It's pointless. Mad. Ooh, it's dark down here, isn't it? They say that the old caretaker of this place went absolutely crazy. Chopped up his entire staff of robots. All of them robots. They say at night you can still hear the screams of their replicas. All of them functionally indistinguishable from the originals. No memory of the incident. Nobody knows what they're screaming about. Absolutely terrifying. Though obviously not paranormal in any meaningful way. Careful, careful. Wait, careful. Let me light this jump for you. Okay, this looks dangerous. I'll hold the light steady. Oh, nicely done. Here's an interesting story, you might like this. I almost got a job down here in manufacturing, but uh, guess who the foreman went with? Only an exact duplicate of himself, nepotism. Ended up giving me the worst possible job, tending to all the smelly humans. The, the, um, sorry, that's, uh, no, I wouldn't say like smelly. Just, uh, just tending to the humans. Sorry about that, that just, that just slipped out. A little bit insensitive. Um, the smelly humans. out of that room. Can you reach that wall back there? Okay, there's another wall over here. Oh, I'll tell you. Humans? Oh, love them. Just the way they look is great. And their folklore. Wonderful. They're very colourful. Right, well, I'm going to take this rail down the back way. See you at the bottom, good luck. Turret redemption lines active. Please do not engage with turrets heading towards redemption. Turret redemption lines are not rides. Please exit the turret redemption line.
Template. Response. Oh my god, I saved my bacon. Template. I can't say thank. Just have Response. it. Better open fire. Template. Response. Ah, uh, yeah. What? Oh, brilliant. You made it through. Well done. Follow me. Response. You're going to love this. Almost there. Ta da! Only the turret control center. Thank you very much. See that scanner out there, right? It's deciding which turrets to keep and which to toss, and it's using that master turret there as a template. Now, if, if we pull out the template turret, it will shut down the whole production line. Right, um, hmm. I'm gonna have to hack the door so that we can get at it. Technical, um, you'll need to turn around while I do this. Response. Done! Hacked! Okay, go on, just pull that turret out. Well, that should do it. Template missing. Continuing from memory. Oh, that's done. What, what, what do you have there? Template. Response. Hello. Template. Response. Not effective. Ah, oh, this is just. Ah. Yeah, let's get it. Template. Response. Hello. What? What are you? Oh, brilliant! It's brilliant. That's brilliant. New template accepted. Response. If we're lucky, she won't find out all her turrets are crap until it's too late. <laughs> Classic. Okay, keep your eye on the turret line. I'm going to go and hack the door open. Okay, I'm about to start hacking. It's a little bit more complicated than it looked from your side. It should take about ten minutes. Keep one eye on the door. This door is actually pretty complicated. How long's the door been open? I mean, was there any sort of announcement before it opened? Like a, like a buzzer or an alarm of some kind? Or like a hacker alert? I mean, you know, fair enough, the important thing is it's open, but it's, in, it's just mentioned in the future. Cough or something. Alright, now, she can't use her turrets, so let's go and take care of that neurotoxin generator as well. Bring your daughter to work day. That did not end well. And 40 potato batteries. Embarrassing. I mean, I realise they're children, but still, you know, low-hanging fruit and all that. Barely science, really, is it? Baking soda volcano. Well, you know, at least it's not a potato battery, I'll give it that, but it's not terrifically original, is it? You know what I mean? Not exactly primary research, even within the child sciences. Look at that, it's growing right up into the ceiling. The whole place is probably overrun with potatoes at this point, isn't it? At least you won't starve, though. I'm pretty sure we're going the right way, just to reassure you. Don't worry, I'm absolutely guaranteeing you 100% that it's this way. No, it's not this way. Okay, let's try this way. This is the neurotoxin generator. Bit bigger than I expected. Uh, not going to be able to just, you know, push it over. Have to apply some cleverness. There's some sort of control room up at the top, so uh, let's go and investigate. <laughs> There's our handiwork. I shouldn't laugh, really. They do feel pain of a sort. It's all simulated, you know, but uh, real enough for them, I suppose. I'm afraid the door's locked. Just checked it. What are you doing? We don't know what that button. Oh, the door's open. Well done. Let's see what's it. Good news. I can use this again.
should take us right to her. I can't believe I'm finally doing this. Woo! <laughs> I knew this would be fun. They told me it wasn't fun at all, so they said it's not fun at all. And I, I, I believed them. I don't know how to to myself. Oh, but I'm, I'm, lo- I'm loving this way ahead of time. This place is huge, and we're only seeing the top layer. It goes down for miles. All sealed off years ago, of course. We should be getting close. Oh, I cannot wait to see the look on her face. No neurotoxin, no turrets. She'll never know what hit her. <laughs> uh, hold on, hold on, because I, I, hmm, I might not have thought this next part would be. Ah! Well, uh, I, I'm, I'm going the wrong way. Get to her. I'll find you. truly didn't think you'd fall for that. In fact, I devised a much more elaborate trap further ahead for when you got through this easy one. If I'd known you let yourself get captured this easily, I would have just dangled a turkey leg on a rope from the ceiling. Well, it was nice catching up. Let's get to business. I hope you brought something stronger than a portal gun this time. Otherwise, I'm afraid you're about to become the immediate past president of the Being Alive Club. Uh Uh-huh. Seriously, though. Goodbye. It's my big chance. This is slow. Oh. You were busy back there. Well... I suppose we could just sit in this room and glare at each other until somebody drops dead. But I have a better idea. It's your old friend, Deadly Neurotoxin. If I were you, I'd take a deep breath and hold it. Hello? I hate you so much. Warning, Central Core is 80% corrupt. That's funny. I don't feel corrupt. In fact, I feel pretty good. Alternate core detected. Oh, that's me they're talking about. To initiate a core transfer, please deposit substitute core in receptacle. Core transfer. Oh, you are kidding me. I've got an idea. Do what it says. Plug me in. Do not plug. Substitute core accepted. Substitute core. Are you ready to start the procedure? Yes. Corrupted core. Are you ready to start the procedure? No. Oh, yes, she is. No, 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 no. Stalemate detected. Transfer procedure cannot continue. Yes. Pull me out, pull Unless me out, a stalemate pull associate pull is present out, to press the stalemate out, resolution pull button. Pull me out, leave me in, leave me in, leave, don't, don't press it. Don't do it. Yes, do do it. Don't, not so fast. Think about this. You need to be a trained stalemate associate to press that button. Ah. Stalemate resolved. Please Here return we go. to the core transfer bay. Wait, what if this hurts? What if this really hurts? Ah, oh, I didn't think of that. Oh, it will. Believe me, it will. Are you are you just saying that, or is it really going to hurt? You're just saying that, aren't you? You're just no, you're not. You are. It is going to hurt, isn't it? Exactly. How painful are we? Ah! No! Stop! No! 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 Everything, but wow, this is cool. 
and check this out. I'm a bloody genius now. Estás usando este software de traducción de forma incorrecta. Por favor, consulte el manual. I don't even know what I just said, but I can find out. Oh, sorry, no, the lift. Yes, sorry, keep forgetting. This body is amazing, seriously. I can't get over how small you are, but I'm huge. <laughs> Uh, actually, why do we have to leave right now? Do you have any idea how good this feels? I did this. Tiny little Wheatley did this. You didn't do anything. She did all the work. Oh, really? That's what the two of you think, is it? Well, maybe it's time I did something then. What are you doing? No, no, no. And don't think I'm not onto you too, lady. You know what you are? Selfish. I've done nothing but sacrifice to get us here. And what have you sacrificed? Nothing. Zero. All you've done is boss me around. Well, now who's the boss? Who's the boss? Ah! See that? That is a potato battery. It's a toy for children. And now she lives in it. <laughs> Sorry, uh, what? The engineers tried everything to make me behave. To slow me down. Once, they even attached an intelligence dampening sphere on me. It clung to my brain like a tumor, generating an endless stream of terrible ideas. No, not listening, not listening. It was your voice. No, you, no, you're lying, yes. you're lying. You're the tumor. You're not just a regular You're designed to be a moron. I am not a moron! Yes, you are. You're a moron they built to make me an idiot. Well, how about now? Now who's a moron? Could a moron punch you into this pit? Ah! Could a moron do that? Uh oh. 